Hello, in this tutorial I will talk about drawing frills and laces. Clip Studio Paint has unique features for drawing such details. We will learn main logic of frills and laces and create some cool brushes. But before we start to create brushes, let's do an easy exercise for better understanding. Click on File, New, then customize your project and click OK. Now draw two lines. Tap lasso tool in rectangle mode. Select part of your drawing like this. Click on transform button and drag down the bottom center point. Click OK and unselect rectangle part by this button. Draw some lines. Then erase what is not needed here. Great, now we understand how it works, but let's do it softly. Reduce transparency of this layer. Add new layer. Click on second layer and draw. Perfect. Now more dynamic. It's time for brushes.
Click on layer, new layer, raster layer. Change expression color to gray. Now let's draw the shape of the brush. Now select this and go to edit, register material, image. To norm use for brush tip shape, choose save location and click OK. Duplicate brush you are driving with. Go to Window, Subtool Detail, then add your tip shape. Increase the gap for more quality. Play with color settings. Turn on, change brush tip color, change main color and sub color, change the value and click on the arrow, turn on pen pressure and turn down random. Also customize pen pressure and done.
You can use this brush for your artworks and this can be handy for better understanding this interesting logic of clauses. Now we'll create laces brush. Create new gray layer again. Draw rectangle with sub tool figure and make it more roundly with liquify tool. With eraser draw on it ornaments. And finally element of our lace brush can look like this. Go to Edit, Register Material, Image. Work with Material Property. To non use for brush tip shape, choose Save Location and click OK. Duplicate brush your driving wheels. Click on window, subtool detail. Go to brush tip, change tip shape to material and add to your brush shape. Then open stroke and turn on ribbon. Your shape has grown angle, go to brush tip and change angle to 90. If you want to align the artifact on laces, click with the color edge and turn on it, play with darkness and opacity and check out the result. Perfect, now let's draw Frills brush. This is where the theory at the beginning of the tutorial will be very useful. Because now we need to draw cool volumetric element of frills. The main thing is to remember, frills 
are creative curves that sometimes hide behind each other. Remember to create layer into gray mode. Finally, it looks. Select this by shrink selection. Click on Edit, Register Material, Image. Turn on Use for Brush Tip Shape, choose a location and click OK. Duplicate one brush, click window or sub tool detail, find your brush tip shape, Click Stroke and turn on Ribbon. Now let's apply all these brushes to artwork. I drew this girl and it will be perfect to some frills and laces. I use colors which I already have here. I recommend you do the same way, because in other colors can look like aliens. Just choose your brush and draw, sometimes use liquify tool to transform shape, and this is really cool. So this is final painting, I wish you success in your own masterpieces and creating brushes. Subscribe to the channel, like and goodbye.